faking it in a real relationship. I'm sure so many women can relate, but you don't know how to achieve an orgasm. You don't know. How do you expect your man to know? Mm -hmm. I especially didn't know. We would be intimate and he would be putting his best foot forward. But yeah. even if I didn't feel it, I would still be performative. Mm -hmm. So yes, I was faking it. But once you start, how do you stop? But once you start, how do you stop? How do you stop? Hurt my heart though, I ain't gonna lie. I hurt my heart, I, I might've cried a couple of times, but we got into like a, a argument and then she was like, well, you know, I don't be having an orgasm. You unlock this door with a key of fuckery. Beyond it is a weird dimension, a dimension of sound, a dimension of sight, a dimension of mind. You're moving into a land of both buffoonery and fuckery. Wait, there it is. Just over the horizon, you've entered the cuckery zone. What is good, everybody? This is SFC Spectacular. Back on his mic to rock your body ride, and I'm back for another video real quick tonight. I'm here to talk about how the cuckery never ends. So it apparently, apparently DJ Envy, who has never really been much of a man, has been put on the spot by his wife. Hey yo, what the fuck? To talk about their sex life and how she's been faking it on the Shade Room interview. And it is my understanding this is all for the sales of books. So how did that conversation even come about? Like, Envy, where you were like, am I not performing enough? Uh, one night we were in bed and uh, we were having sex. And um, she was just, I, I remember in the middle of it, she was like, uh, yes, but no. And I well, no matter what DJ Envy wants to sell his manhood for, I believe it's a bad idea. But hey, Mr. Envy believes he should sit there looking like- Once you start, how do you stop? While his wife tells stories about how he, she used to fake it till she made it. Wow, he just sat there the whole time, bro. No! Like, if this reminds me of the whole Will Smith situation. And it's sad to see a lot of brothers out here, or men in general, taking this kind of mess and thinking it's okay. I will say this to you. If you're the person that says, it's, it is okay, well, how come half the internet is joking him then? If it was factually okay for this man to sit here and be his sexual um, performance to be berated, if that was normal, then why is half the internet like, ha ha ha, clown, Because you know why? It's not. It's not okay. You ain't lying. That's right. It's not okay. So I'm gonna say to Mr. DJ Envy, pick your nuts up, man. Get your life together, bro. Six kids with this woman, and this how she talked about you? Oh, we learned, we grew. Half sway. Sure, guy. You keep telling yourself that. All right, what do you guys think? I'm gonna make this real quick video. I don't wanna be here all day. Tell me what you think about this down in the uh, comments. Do you think there's enough cuckery going around for everybody? Do you think Will Smith is still the king of it or has DJ Envy pulled up and claimed the championship? You let me know. Until next time, guys. Remember, if you can't be good, be good at it. I'm out of here. Peace.